Hey guys, what's going on? It's Non-Weapon Arch Preparedness back with you. Today I want to talk about renewable energy and one of those ways that you can get renewable energy is by solar panels. Now, these are two uh, these are two very low wattage solar panels. They're about six watts a piece, but they get the job done. I gotta tell ya. And the charge controller that I have is a PWM charge controller which really does suit my needs as far as a charge controller that works with these two solar panels. Now, I have not road tested this in quite a long time. So I just might take this out to the park and set it up on a park bench and test it out but it's got a couple of Anderson power pole connections on it and that's the emergency communication standard of Anderson power pole which which are these right there and I got to tell you without my solar setup, I don't know where I would be as a prepper because I have had to rely on this solar panel setup for numerous occasions, the latest of which being last week's rolling blackouts due to the snow. And I got to tell you, it was a really good test of the solar panel to be 100% operational under minimal lighting. We only had about... 50% sunlight and these these bad boys still run still ran I think that's a really good investment to have solar panels on your bug out property with everything that we have going on in the world today with EMP attacks and stuff like that, you just never know when the grid's gonna go down. And you just never know when it's gonna come back up after going down. So I'm gonna end the live video, I'm gonna end the video here, but please don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And click the notification bell so you never miss an upload from me. It's been real, guys. Non-weaponized preparedness. Signing off for now.